Hello everybody and welcome to a new video, this is Offline today guys, we have a new video about Summoner's World today, we're gonna have a look at another insane damage dealer for Giant B12, for free to play players, this, uh, this unit is actually insane, it's extremely hard and uh, kind of easy to build and she, uh, she actually does a lot, I really like this unit, I used to use this unit in the early GB10 at that time, and then, uh, well, when GB12 came out, it was not early game anymore. Uh, but this is a free-to-play unit. <clears throat> Can gather uh, really, really good damage dealer, really, really good nuker, pretty fast team. I'm doing the ten time run, so we can see how the average is after I show you the rune on this unit. Um, but I really, really like this unit. You should skill her up if you <laughs> is gonna do a lot more damage. Uh, but I don't have her skilled up. I'm gonna show you the runes, obviously. Uh, but guys, this unit is gonna help you a lot in GB early GB12. You can keep her even later on. Uh, she does work really, really well, and she works even on uh, the water rift beast. Uh, if you do need uh, those uh, accuracy <coughs> determination runes, sorry for the three color team, you can find that and use this unit. Guys, before we get into the video, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. It's free and support the channel a whole lot, guys. So if you can, please hit sub button. It really, really helps. Now, the unit in question is a Rang. A Rang is insane. It's the Nantel Fox. I, for some reason, I always get Nantel Fox from the four star when I summon, but for some reason, I don't have a skilled up. I don't, I don't know why. I don't have her skilled up. Try to skill her up. This skill does a lot of damage. But let's see what she does. Attack enemy free time with a shimmer light. Each strike has 15% chance of increasing the enemy's chance of landing a glancing hit, which would protect you from the giant a little bit. Although you should have Lauren in the team, which is free to play, and you should be protected anyway. Uh, skill 2 throws so bad at the enemy to deal damage and still one beneficial effect granted on the enemy. So she doesn't only strip, she actually steals stuff. So I'm pretty sure you could use her even in like Siege Offense probably. It's pretty good. Uh, soul Bads, it doesn't say how many Soul Bads, but Beats, sorry. In addition, recover the same amount of inflicted damage as HP. self sustain as well, and she does decent damage on skill 2 as well, but skill 3 is what hit really, really hard. Hard. Attack the enemy and increase its attack speed, attack power, and defense for two turns. So she has attack break in one hit, in one skill, attack break, attack slow, and defense rate. The damage dealt to the enemy under harmful effect will be increased by 50%. On a free turn cooldown, attack leader skill also 40% uh, is pretty good, but in my opinion, you should use Lucian uh, in Giant B12. Yes, Lucian is not free to play, guys, but there is a Ja uh, there is um, an event where you can choose your own 4 star, the one you want, you should definitely go for Lucian, that speeds up the giant a lot. If you don't have Lucian though, you can use Sigmarus <coughs> for giant B12, uh, I mean you need an AoE in a way that the waves, first and third wave, get clear as fast as possible so you have a faster time. The runes are like this, I went Fatal, you can go Rage up to you uh, but yeah focus on crit rate focus on attack on crit damage and uh, try to get 85 crit rate so she actually always crit on giant i uh, have 83 i think is enough it's okay and she probably should move last in the team she could move before crow because then she put this amount of debuffs on the enemy and crow can actually one shot the giant but she can move after crow it's fine uh i think before crow might be better because she does have uh, debuffs on skill three she has three debuffs uh so it might work even better now the team is like this 10 time runs is not done so i'm gonna quickly show you uh the runes on the other units uh, i showed you the runes in that of the other units in previous video I'm gonna show them again, actually no, because the Barbarian King moves first, triple fight, attack with damage, no, speak with damage attack, uh, triple fight for Lucian obviously and for the other damage dealers, that's the Lucian, you need 85 crit rate only on Lucian, so you can actually crit uh, on the, in Giant, so that's the Lucian, attack with damage attack, 
um, and then Lauren moves <coughs> sorry about that Lauren moves she's on a random set you don't need violence you don't need nemesis you can go full broken and make a move after Lucian and Crow is like this uh, ideally you want 100 crit rate on Crow I feel like over 85 is always decent uh, you don't need will for giant but use Crow in other places like dimensional hole so it does need will in those uh, places so it doesn't get the dots uh, but you don't need if you're using crow just for giant don't need will rage is the better way and again the closer to 100 crit rate the better oh yeah definitely the better so this is the team um obviously <laughs> the ai should work in a way that Barbarian King does kill free on the first wave. As soon as the giant run starts, that's how it should work. That doesn't always work like that. But yeah, it should work in a way that the Barbarian King does kill free, Lucian does kill free uh, over here like this. Lucian does kill free, so you clear the wave real quick. AI is not perfect, um, it does work most times but sometimes it doesn't really go as planned the it should work anyway even if it doesn't do that because obviously you get attack buff from the barbaric king lucian should still do a lot of damage and lauren with valent in that case is better because she can actually decrease attack bar on multiple uh, targets although if she defense break one of them she's still gonna focus that unit so that's how it should work barbaric king does that lucian does that hopefully then you land the branding and uh, lauren does land her stuff and then you can just kill that now he should have skill free again it doesn't go for it lucian does skill free anyway and my lucian almost can clear the waves anyway so i might even go lucian first if i buff a little bit more attack on him and then you know but yeah rang is actually a really really good unit it's free to play you can fuse her you can fuse her so definitely good uh, good unit and let's see the average I mean the, the previous run probably okay we got the best clear <laughs> it just got the best clear with the rank um, okay <laughs> okay but a rank is insane and I, I haven't used a rank in a long time but I might use a rank again as she's doing work obviously uh, rank insane unit guys it's free to play you can fuse her and you can fuse skill ups really I wouldn't say you should fuse the skill up but yeah she's here you can get her from the fusion uh, and yeah just use her guys that's gonna be it for the video if you have any question obviously ask in the comment below thank you guys so much for watching the video hope you enjoyed it I'll see you on the next one bye bye everybody take care guys stay safe bye